finale. Evening Maelstrom. Scoot out of here. Elm Grove Misty. Julep Hanover, Charlotte's Western. Windermere Nancy and tell me why on the outside, top of the stretch. Approaching a start. Finale time. Well back, leaving the two scoot out of here. The rest are up and pacing. Leading them out, it's Charlotte's Western. Second into the turn towards the inside is Evening Maelstrom. Driving up on the outside to be third, Julep Hanover. On the turn, Windermere Nancy goes fourth. Then in fifth, that is Elm Grove Missy. Sixth in the early going is Tell Me Why. And the trailer after the tardy start is scoot out of here. They're on the back stretch for time one and Julep Hanover in line to Wade Myers cleared the lead. Racing from second is Charlotte's Western. Evening Maelstrom along the inside third. Windermere Nancy in mid-pack fourth. The quarter mile in 29 seconds flat. Racing from fifth as they move on around the turn. Arriving at the 3 8 pole is Elm Grove Misty. Then in six is Tell Me Why. Trailing the field, that's scoot out of here. Down the stretch for time one. And on the front end, that's Jula Panover, the midway point leader. Here comes company. Windermere Nancy first up for Dowling. Third up the rail to Charlotte's Western. Moving second over the outside fourth is Elm Grove Misty. On the cones is Evening Maelstrom fifth. Six on the outside is Tell Me Why. Trailing the field, scoot out of here. One minute. Two fifths for that opening half mile. They go to the back stretch for the second and final time. Three quarters coming next. In at the rail, Julep Hanover. From the outside, Windermere Nancy, the challenger. Charlotte Western right there in the pocket third. Fourth on the outside is Elm Grove Misty. Nowhere to go. Fifth is Evening Maelstrom. The three quarters in one. 31 flat. Rounding the turn. Final time with an eighth to go. Jula Panover turning for home. Charlotte Western is second. In at the rail, Evening Maelstrom third. Deep in the stretch, Jula Panover. Charlotte Western coming to her late. Here's the wire. Charlotte Western and Campbell will triple up. Second is Jula Panover. Evening Maelstrom third. One, 59 and one. Great finish in the finale here at Red Shores in Charlottetown on a Thursday night. We'll get the replay for you here now. Jula Panover finally cleared up and got to the front here tonight. Ray Super 29 to the opening panel. One minute two. And Mark was sitting there just watching it all unfold. 131 three quarters. And these two mares are going to hook up down the stretch here now as Jula Panover, the classy veteran, tries to dig in and hang on here for Wade Myers. Mark coming with Charlotte's Western on the outside. And in the final strides, Mark is going to reach up here and just get past Jula Panover late. Charlotte Western wins it. Jula Panover, a game effort for second. Evening Maelstrom is third. 5-4-1 wraps it up in Charlottetown on a Thursday night. Well, Mark Campbell has three trips to the winner's circle on this night, and they're all from his own barn. Triples up in the training side, triples up in the driver's seat, and he does it in the nightcap with number five, Charlotte's Western. Bay pacing mare six by Western Paradise from the Mohegan Pride Dam OG Starlet. Owned by Henry Smallwood of Cooksbrook and Cyril Harvey of Elmsdale, Nova Scotia, Mark Campbell, the trainer driver, 159-1, the time for the mile. Charlotte's Western in the 11th. 